What's up, Togator Hunter Nation? Coming at you for week two. We're in beautiful Provo, Utah, gonna watch the BYU Cougars. Let's go hit it. Brigham Young University, or BYU, is located right in the heart of Provo, Utah. While being most known for a religious university, they've also been able to put out some top athletes, from Ty Detmer to Steve Young. For this week's episode, we were able to interview with some of the people who make up the college tailgate for BYU, especially Mr. Jackson Unga, who told us his story and how he's connected to the university. So obviously your family's been into football for a long time. We just saw the rings. Tell us a little <laughs> bit about those, your, your experience with football as well as your son's. Uh, my experience with football, I don't know how to play football. You don't know how to but, play football? Well, I'll talk about my sons. I'm, I'm a proud dad. Um, my older boy uh, played here three years. And then he got drafted to the Bears on the Sumpermental draft. But uh, as a, he's a good kid. In the middle of his third year, he broke the all-time rushing record at BYU. It sounds like what you guys you? have a lot of athletes, Sim family. Super yeah. humble. He also played for BYU yeah. back in, was it the yeah. 70s you were saying? I, I came in and... I was the water boy, you know. You were the water boy. I, I, just like I, my buddy Gator last I, year. I created a new position. It's called get back. The get back. Yes. And what, what does the get back do? Try to run in as they said, get back outside. <laughs> hey, there you go. There you go. Well, but, tons uh, of tradition stuff. Now, not as much family on the field, right? So you do everything before a game. What's your favorite part about coming out here pregame? Also, we got the grill going. What do you love? I, I believe it's the, the supporting of the, the, not just the team, but the school. And, uh, you know, we're all alumni here at BYU. And uh, the camaraderies, you know, having, I have my, my first cousins here for USC today. And I brought towels for them to wipe their tears when the, after the game. There we go. But uh, the, I guess the camaraderies, the, the having the friends, families, you know, everybody and anybody that come here and want to partake of some of this stuff and, uh, you know, just show support, love. I think that's really mm. cool about all the family connections that he has here. Mm. Just in our few moments here, everybody walking through always comes, give him a hand, handshake, a hug. Looks like a great guy here. So thank you for your time, Jason. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right, so I'm here with Jason, huge BYU fan. Woo! Oh, yeah. How long you been out here for? Oh man, it's, so I've been out here for a couple hours right now, uh, but we come every week and just support our Cougars. Go there, Cougs! There you go. How long you been coming to the games for? Years? Oh, years, years. So my dad actually took us back. Um, we, I've got three older brothers, and uh, ever since we were little, my dad's been taking us to BYU games. Dang so, God. so what, 37 years? 37 years. What's your favorite part about coming down here? Um. To watch them win. You'll love to watch the Cougars <laughs> win. Well, hey, there you go. Hope you guys yeah. get to see that win tonight. Big game against USC. So, Thank you. So best of luck with it. Appreciate you. What makes BYU fans unique? I would say BYU fans are unique because no matter where you go, there's always going to be BYU fans. What's your favorite tradition for college tailgating? Oh, uh, just getting together with family and friends, uh, hanging out before the games, and just cheering all the nephews. And here with some of the students, what's your favorite part about being here? Uh, just getting hyped for the game, camping out, you know, getting that 24 hours of the pregame in, uh, getting people excited, getting a little rowdy beforehand. And do they get rowdy. The new pregame experience for Cougar fans is what's called Cougar Canyons. Local bands, local food trucks, as well as games line the front entrance to the stadium to make sure all the kids and fans are ready for the game. What's your favorite part of BYU games? Oh man, just being with my people. Uh, 63,000 unified folks mm -hmm. from around the country. I'm from Colorado, we got some Utahns. My, my brother comes out from Texas. It's just a chance to get everybody together, friends from college, and uh, cheer on our Cougars. Cougars represent our people, and, and we're proud to, to be backers. I gotta say, it's amazing that you guys show up to all the games, like crazy, all over the country. Like, that's, that's wild, right? You guys got a killer fan base out from BYU, so. Legit, and uh, been all over the country following the Cougs, whether, whether we're wearing white or blue. It's, it's fun to be a fan. I'm here with Grant and Janet, big BYU fans. Woo! Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> Gotta ask, really quick. How many games have you been coming to? You guys diehards, where, where are we at? The whole life, pretty much. Whole life? Yeah. Favorite part about BYU games? The food. The and food. Down. Favorite food? 
some hot dogs. Hot dogs? Yeah. Really? How about you? Uh, cougar tails all the way. Gotta get the cougar tail down here. It's oh, cougar tail, huh? Oh yes, the cougar tail. Over a foot of maple donut goodness. How do you guys show your fandom? You know what? I flew in for the weekend from Chicago. Cross-country flight, not a big deal, but I'm here for the Cougs against USC. The Trojans fight on. Can't really root for them because I'm in Provo. But, hey, they're a powerhouse coming to Provo. you got to respect that. If, you, if you're not going to fly across the country for your team, then why show up, you know? You can, uh, I know last week in Tennessee there were, you know, 10 or 15,000 BYU fans there. Oh, really? So, yeah. Wow. Most of them from the south, right? They didn't, like, travel out. They're from there. So That's phenomenal. And just like you can find Cougar fans anywhere across the country, you can find fans from around the world right here in Provo. And that's definitely found through the food. Nothing better than a tailgate. That's some good old spam moose would be. If you know, you know. Mm. Mm. All right, so I'm here with Marty Hodge. Marty, tell us a little bit about your experience as a fan here. Well, you know what, for what it's worth, the, the wonderful dynamic of, of, of BYU football is, is blowing up right now. So the nicest thing about you guys being here is being able to put this out to the public. Although we're a great nation, it's time to get this thing rolling, you know what I mean? That's what it's all about. Honestly, you have a son on the team, close family ties with the team. What are you doing to help this fan engagement happen, though? Well, the, the one thing you have to do, these guys are a sleeping giant, so a beautiful thing is to just wake them up a little bit. There you so go. that's all we're doing here. We're taking the great white beard. You gotta love the beard, right? Check it and out. we're out that's here. Iconic. If I get called Brigham one more time, I'm probably not gonna like it. My name is Marty Hodge, but it's nice to be out here as a Cougar fan. Hey, there we go. Well, thank you so much, Marty. You're more than welcome, guys. You're the man. Well, that's a wrap here from Lavelle Edwards Stadium. Big shout out to all you Cougs fans. See you next week in LA. Let's get it. What's up, Tailgater Hunter Nation? Coming at you for week two. From beautiful Provo, Utah, checking out the BYU Cougars. Let's go hit Fetch it. and B. Let's oh, hit it. Provo! Let's hit it! Oh. Hit it. <laughs> that that sucker was right after me. All right, that's, all right, that's your bloopers. <laughs> so, bloopers. I was like, Let's go. Holy crap, that was freaking B. All right, Ben. It's curb stomp that. Right? That's a wrap here from Lavelle Edwards Stadium. Right over, I was Ready? <laughs> all right, all right. That's our blooper. Let's stop. <laughs> all right. Ready? Yep.